those of you who are clever at sewing can make your own masks. There you go. Make your own mask. Size to fit you. And pay attention. You can find a template on the interwebs quite easily. It gives you a list of supplies and step-by-step -step instructions. So you can make your own. It's, uh, just make sure you make it four layers thick and use a strong, tightly woven cotton fabric. In addition to any fusible interfacings and so forth you might want to use. Also make sure the ties, if you're tying, on the bottom ones, they have to go up over your ears so it cups your chin a bit. And then the tight one across the front. And if you don't tie them directly behind your ears, nice and tightly now, they have to go all the way around your head. So make sure you do it. But still, if you're going right behind the head, it can be top and bottom of the ear as per normal, as you would with elastic, but if you're just using regular types, it has to go all the way across the top and bottom, up over the ears, both of them, and then tie tightly behind the back of your head. Okay? If you have long hair, you can use your ponytail to help, because you can attach it to the, with the elastic that's holding your tail together okay so there you go one thing you can do to while away the hours next thing you can do if you're worried about food use click to go and such curbside delivery services phone your order in Type your order in online, whatever, pay it by credit card, assuming, of course, if you have money. You know, all of, all of this probably requires a few bucks. And then uh, just have them pop it in the back and you're good to go. Very little social contact. Have things delivered to the house if you can. Auto pay your bills. Sign right on up. Next thing to do is catch up on all that stuff you have to do. Your to-do list. Catch up on that. Get that all done. That should keep you occupied for a while. Or, if you've done all that, distance learning. Wouldn't hurt. And then, my favorite, practice humor. See how many bad jokes you can come up with. Ma, 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 corona. You know, whatever. Make a song up. Something. Anything. And finally, call your people. Aunts, uncles, cousins, grandparents. Second cousins twice removed. Chat. Let them know you exist, that you're alive, that you're hanging in there, and so on. Ask how they are. Come on, get it rolling here. We're all in this together, remember. That includes even those horrible Republican bunch of people, or those horrible Democrats that are also in your family, okay? Just stay away from politics, all right? You'll be fine. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. Please be aware we have over 500,000 now in the United States confirmed. So that means the unconfirmed. We're probably topping up at 750,000 at least because a lot of people have fewer, if any, symptoms. And the other ones aren't going in for loving their money. Usually because they're guys. And guys don't go to the doctor unless, you know, arterial bleeding. A little shortness of breath. Nah. Give me another beer. Whatever. Yeah. You know how it is. You know how it is. Yeah. When you've been married as long as I have. Yeah. You know. 
They ain't going in for loving their money. Okay, so, there you go. Some things you can do to keep yourself happy and going and everything calm. No drama on mind. No drama at all. Now that you've watched everything on Netflix and read everything in the house that there is to read, including the telephone book and the dictionary and the encyclopedia, okay? You know, Got to read something. You can always go back and read. What is that? Skippy's List? There you go. And you can stand there and go, I do recommend finding Skippy's List. Okay, so those are my suggestions. Some tandy tips to help him make it through week two, week three, week six. And the final 100 years of quarantine. Okay, hope this helps. Thank you for watching and please do come again.